It's day two of our adventure here in Ecuador. We have a new member. This is Jay. He just came in from uh, Colorado. But go ahead and tell us your details. Yeah, so I'm Jay Bodwin from Woodland Park, Colorado. Originally a Florida boy, Colorado transplant. Just excited to be here with the guys and have a fun trip climbing. Yep, and he's a veteran of Ecuador. He's been here before. He's been up on some of the other peaks. And his trip, his goal this time is hopefully to get up Antisana. Now, now we're going to board a bus and head on down to our next destination. So let's go. Peace. We're in our bus on our way down to uh, El Chope. We're we'll going to be spending the next three days down there uh, doing some climbing. Today we're going to a beautiful lake, which you'll be seeing shortly. Uh, then we're we'll be taking on El Corazon, as well as Ilanisa Norte, uh, a higher peak for our training. So we had a nice bus, relax, and we're going to kick back and enjoy the view. We're just on a quick stop here to do a bathroom break and to get a few snacks. And then we're ready to push on down the valley. It's a gorgeous day here. I cannot believe how gorgeous the weather is. We've been seeing all the different volcanoes on the ride down. Show your dog. What'd you say in a porno movie? Show that hot dog. Show that dog. <laughs> and you got the uh, Diet Coke to go with it. What? Oh. It's in sugar. Is it really? Yeah, no sugar. Well, so after a three-hour bus ride, we've arrived in the small town of Kilotoa, which is where we're going to begin our day's hike. Uh, it's going to be an easy hike. It's only going to be a, a couple miles. It's not going to be too much an elevation gain. But this is a lovely little village up here in the, uh, the mountains south of uh, Quito. And so um, we're about ready to roll. So let's get moving. Well, we've been joined by an extra special guest today. This is Carla Riga. She's with the Indian Gefeld uh, Reason. She is the tour operator and uh, principal director for planning all of the tours. So say hello to everybody on YouTube. Hello, everybody. Yeah, so this is one of her recommendations for today. So what can you tell us about this place and where we're going? Uh, it's a, a really nice uh, Reina Lake where we are going now. It's, the view is, is really, really nice. You can see it in five minutes. And we walk down to make it a conversation. And yeah, we go back and then enjoy the rest of the day. And a good lunch as well. We're looking of forward course. to lunch. Well, thank you. So let's get moving. Here's my mode of transport right here. If I can just get him to slow down long enough so I can get on board, that'd be a lot easier for me. From here to, to there, to the lake, we have uh, 280 meters, and okay, vertical gain. So we want to walk down there, okay, just to have a nice trek there. And then we're going to walk all in the border of the, the lake and we're going to get out another way. So that is going to take for about um, two hours, maybe. Yeah. Here's some of the trail we'll be going down as we make our way down, 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 and down towards the bottom. Carla has been here several times already. She said the first time she came here, she was pregnant with her daughter, Dominica. Yes. Yes. What's also interesting about this lake down here is the fact that it's still part of an active volcano system, and you can see gases bubbling up out of the water. <laughs> is this is anything we have to worry about? No, no, no worries. No worries. Bueno. One of the things that's interesting about Ecuador, there's uh, two animals that you may be familiar with. One's the llama, the other is the alpaca. The alpaca is slightly larger than the llama. And so a lot of people uh, get an opportunity to uh, ride the uh, alpaca. So maybe right here we'll see somebody getting on. Um, but, uh...
This is the easy way to get up after descending down. Very good. So we've just completed our descent from up above. And there's the trail going back up. Up, 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 up. And there's a cut up there. Right up there where we came down through. Now we are descending down, getting closer and closer to the lake. Here we go, okay. Well, thank you, Miss Carla. When you get down to the lake, and if you're hungry, they have some fantastic food. Look what's on the grill. They got plantains, pollo, cerdo, even fresh watermelon. She's quite the cook. Look at that special sauce. Oh, it looks fantastic. And lunch is served down by the lake. People have been wondering what I'm wearing. I'm wearing the Biko. And I'm wearing the costume that they let me have after the audition for The Shape of Water, also known as the Chico. There you have it. The Chico, the Biko. I got my Biko after seeing Estelan wearing his last year. Okay guys, let's climb. I'm ready. How's the day going? Good? It's great. It is pretty. Take a nice picture there. Yeah, you can hear the bees. Yeah, yeah. See what? Oh, no, I did not. See what? Jay has decided to wear a flower in his hair. Oh, so pretty. to ask where are we? We are in the jungle, in the middle of the jungle. And what you got there in your hand? I think it's menta. Menta. Mmm. Here everyone, let them smell it. Smell that everybody. Smell that? Does that smell good? Thank you. The boys are looking good up there, yeah. Alright, time to push on young lady. Nice trail, huh? The water's cool. that Kodak moment. It's 
It's all uphill from here. It's a nice little drop off. Back down to the lake. All right, mountain guide, how much further? Just a little bit more, five minutes more. Yay! <laughs> Well, it's about 1.55, and we made our climb out of the uh, lake crater. Now we're walking along a ridge line. It's really kind of relaxing. But it was getting very warm in the sun. The air was cool, but when the air stops moving, boy, that sun's cooking you up through here. There's the gang behind us. Woohoo! They're looking good. Great day for a little acclimation hike. I'm glad this was an easy day. This part of Ecuador is really some beautiful country. I'm just gonna do a little bit of a panorama. This is the uh, what it looks like along the side of the uh, volcano as we walk back to our village. Well, we just finished our hike, and now it's time for lunch. We had a great march today. Just sitting down, we're probably sitting down about 1,500 feet in elevation down, and another 1,500 coming back up. Overall, we hiked just over three, maybe in a half hours, getting back at about 250. Now, uh, after a good four mile hike, we're here at our, our little hacienda for a, a very good meal. So we've got the crew here, everything's been served up. It's time to say bon appetit and farewell till next time. Thanks for coming along on today's adventure. Good appetit.